Today we hear in our first reading from the prophet Ezekiel. And the, really the central theme of this particular reading is that the Lord God is asking the prophet Ezekiel to remind the Old Testament people of their covenant relationship that he would be their God and that we would be his people. So through that central theme of covenant, it implies faithfulness. And then in the gospel from uh, Matthew, we hear Jesus giving us a lesson about the covenant relationship of man and woman in the sacrament of marriage that it is an unbondable, uh, unbreakable bond. But when a, a, a husband and wife exchange vows, they're establishing, they're giving the sacrament to each other. They're establishing that covenant relationship before God and for others who are there at the wedding. So we do pray today in response to the scriptures that all of us can be faithful to our covenant relationship with God. This uh, relationship was established when you and I were baptized and as we receive the other sacraments of the church. We pray in particular for couples that they might live out their covenant relationship, that their relationship will be a true sign of God's presence and that they might witness that love in the world. As I mentioned, today's also the feast, the memorial of St. Maximilian Kolbe, uh, a saint who was very um, beloved in our church, especially in Poland. Um, he was a native of Poland and became a priest and was martyred for the faith in Auschwitz. Uh, one of my trips to uh, Europe. I went to Poland and got to see many uh, wonderful sites there. Uh, we did go to Auschwitz and I um, got to be in the room where Maximilian died. So it was a very somber, very um, profound moment to realize that this saint uh, gave up his life for an another prisoner. So it's a great uh, lesson of sacrifice and how he lived his covenant relationship with God. 